Hi, everybody. Welcome to the show. Um, let me just give you this preface because I try to I try to be an honest human being when I can. I don't think that this video is particularly valuable. And if you were going to skip any video on the channel, it's probably a good one to do it because I don't think there's much of a point to it other than here is a type of real estate agent that I would be a little suspicious of, you know, if I, if I could be candid with you, I'd be a little like, you sure about that one, bro? And who, who, what kind of agent am I talking about? I'm talking about the kind of agents that pitch you on this notion of, I, I got it. Cause you'll see it on a lot of like real estate websites, right? I got into real estate because I believe in the dream of home ownership and families building a, 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 you know, this incredible existence for each other and the American dream, home ownership. It, it's, it's like, guys, can I be, I like to think that we could trust each other on this channel. Can I be honest with you on why people get their real estate license? They get their real estate. The only reason anyone gets their real estate license is for money. Okay. That's it. That's it. Okay. Like, there's the moral of the entire real estate industry is the only reason anyone gets into it is to make money. It is not because it's the most enjoyable thing in the world. You could argue, yeah, there's some time flexibility, like, yeah, you know, okay, cool. You can make your own schedule, but like, look at the end of the day, it's because people think that there's a lot of money to be made in real estate. Well, there might be, that is for like any other industry. It's for a very small segment of the people that work in it that make th those big dollars, right? I, I've worked in it for a few years and yeah, I mean, I, you know, do enough deals to, I guess, be above average, but it's like, look, I'm not balling on real estate money, guys, if I'm, if I'm leveling with you and I didn't get into it because I was trying to save the world. I got into it because I thought, ah, no, I think I might be able to make some money with that. And you can, right? It's just at, at, at what cost. There's a movie that it, it makes me think of uh, called Boiler Room. It was maybe early 2000s, maybe even 90s. And uh, it's an early Ben Affleck movie. And uh, there's a great speech in there where he's motivating his young stockbrokers that he's recruiting. And, and he just says, look, we're not saving the fucking manatees here, guys. You know, anyone that tells you that we are like, he's like, fuck them. And real estate is very much the same way. We ain't saving the manatees here, everyone. Like, we're helping you buy a house. I'm not saying that owning a home is not like a nobody, you know, that helping you in that is not like significant. It is, but it's not noble. You're doing it because you wanted to make money. And that's fine. Half the message I have inside of the real estate industry is just like, we should just be more open and honest with people. Like, real estate is not fun. It's not. Doing loans, you know, lender watching this telling me that doing loans is a blast the fuck out of here, dude. You do it because you make money. And that's fine. Just admit it. Just admit it. Okay. So be a little suspicious, right? If you're, if you got that agent who's just selling you on like, it's my pleasure to help you the Chick-fil-A. It's my pleasure to help you with the achieving the American dream of home ownership. You're like, just fucking stop, dude. Just sell me the house and make your money and let's move on. Debbie Downer over here, everyone. Just freaking Debbie Downer. But it is the reality. I'm not really wrong on that. It's just, um, you know, whatever. So um, me and this dog, we're going to go. We're going to go do something else with ourselves. Um, if you need real estate help, like, like I told you, we'll help you. And we're efficient at helping you do that. Um, and we would like for you to do that. Um, and we will be open and honest with you throughout that entire process. If we can help, great. If we cannot, we will tell you that. We'll give you a fair shake. That's what we do around here. So me and this fat dog going to go away. See you guys next time.